Some girls like a wild Bonjour. To come Comment ça va? Greetings, hats and cats. This is your friendly jazz singer, Carrie Chris, joining you from Paris, France, for another Create Now, sponsored by the Nebraska Arts Council. A one, a two, a one, two. Well, if I had a cat that I could call my kitten. Demystifying the creative process. So before we get started, um, I just wanted to take the opportunity to thank the Nebraska Arts Council for inviting me and a number of teaching artists that are on the Nebraska Arts Council roster to share some of our experience with the creative process with you all. Now you might be wondering, who the heck is Carrie Christ? Why is she in Paris? Is she really in Paris? And what is she doing associated with the Nebraska Arts Council? So, in a nutshell, how can I say this briefly? I was born in Iowa. When four years old, my family moved to Saudi Arabia, where I was in elementary school. Did middle school and high school back in Ohio. Uh, so Midwestern to the core. Went to Chicago for college, Northwestern University, where I got three degrees in French studies, jazz studies, and then a master's in jazz pedagogy. Then moved to Paris, France, which was the love of my life ever since I was five years old, and have been here for the past 20 years or so, or since the turn of the century, as I like to say. And since I moved to Paris, I've been performing around the world as both a soloist and in various ensembles in France, Midwest, around in and around Africa. And so what is the Nebraska connection, you might ask? By a strange set of circumstances, I ran into Rick Maddox while I was working in Djibouti, Africa for the U.S. State Department. Uh, doing musical outreach and he invited me to Nebraska to work with his kids at Hastings High School and some of the elementary schools and soon I ended up on the Nebraska Arts Council roster but that's not what we're here about. We're here to talk about the creative process, whatever the heck that means. Why the creative process? Uh, the Nebraska Arts Council asked me to talk about something along those lines because they saw that during this crazy pandemic, we were on full lockdown in France. And despite everything, I felt a strong urge to continue to connect with other musicians, audience members, students around the world to keep my sanity. And we all need that today. We all have a creative spirit inside of us that yearns to express itself. And basically, uh, I'd like to just take you through a series of steps, I mean, I pulled this stuff together after thinking about what was my own mental process while I was creating the various different things that you see here, not all music related. I pulled out the common threads between the different projects and how my process worked with through that. And I'm hoping it might inspire some of you all while we're at it. <laughs> 